Okay, just got the RV back. Had some warranty work done, some body work done. Body work's covered in their final, covered in another video. But what I decided to do, because I had this uh, gone for about three months, I uh, emptied it. So now it's time to load it back up. And what I've done is I have calculated beyond just weighing it, I calculated the distribution of the weights uh, as it goes in here. So this is my crude layout. So in the forward left compartment I've got 60 pounds. In the forward right compartment I have 65 pounds. In the center uh, basement area I have roughly 75 pounds. In the left rear compartment, I've got 15 pounds. And in the right rear compartment, I've got 24 pounds. I may put uh, 20, 30 pounds of uh, drinks in the uh, entertainment compartment there, where the TV is folded up in there. And that is the extent of the weight distribution. And I'll run through it. Up front here, because my slides are on the other side, I'm going to put my tools in this area. That extension ladder, by the color you can tell it's it's one of the heavier duty ones. It goes up to like 14 feet. It can, I think, hold 300 pounds. I got a map there. But that ladder weighs 25. Now the tool, my tools will go here. Those are going to weigh total 65 pounds. That's where I'm going to keep my water and my brewskis uh, when they're not in the ice chest. So you could calculate a case of water and 30 pack of beer there, maybe 30 pounds. Uh, that's my uh, propane uh, compartment and I keep my towels in there, not much weight. In this compartment I keep uh, my, my chemicals, uh, waxes, cleaners, a little bit of oil there, cones. And then there's uh, uh, a leaf blower and some uh, dusters. And this compartment here weighs uh, around 30 pounds. In this section, back here, is where I keep my RVI brake system for the Toad and the Falcon 2 tow bar. Other than the tow bar, which is approximately 36 pounds, that will be on the hitch, and the rest of this will be in the toad. So this this weight here is not in my uh, a distribution uh, factor because it will not be on board when I tow. This grill, 20 pounds. So I keep some wheel covers, some hoses a uh, mover's blanket. That's good for 15 pounds. Got approximately uh, 20 pounds in uh, sewer hose and uh, other uh, accessories there for the uh, utilities. This compartment has the APU, so that's part of the base uh, coach weight. And then I've got a uh, compressor, some uh, air tool, uh, air tools, adhesives, charger, 25 foot extension or a jumper, and some other let's see uh, shovel in there, and that's good for uh, 60 pounds. And I got a couple chairs and extension cords. Uh, the chairs combined weigh about 25 pounds, and those extension cords pretty heavy. They weigh about 25 pounds. So, all in all, that is uh, the distribution that I have. Now, the, the capability of capacity is 1,800 pounds on this coach. So, I'm, I'm around 10% of what I could carry. So, that's where I'm going to uh, address the tire pressure. Uh, considering additional weight to put in there uh, for cooking utensils, food, clothes.
clothes, any Coco and Kathy. So based on those calculations, that's what I will adjust my air pressure down to. It's approximately uh, 80 pounds uh, in the rear and about 78 pounds up front. I may come down a couple more pounds. It rode fantastic coming back from the RV dealer. Um, very quiet, very smooth, no sway with that uh, cheap handling fix. So just an overall dialed in uh, rig at this point. So if you watch my other videos, you'll see what I've gone through to make adjustments, which everyone will have to uh, do at some point. It's the order that they do it and uh, how they uh, identify what needs to be done, control uh, uh, exactly what is being done so that you can then make adjustments from what uh, has been accomplished to see if there's a d additional uh, changes that need to be made. Anyway, I'm going to continue on here and uh, get this thing loaded uh, or buttoned up, take it over to storage and uh, that will uh, conclude this walk around. Okay, thanks for watching. Happy trails.